Stop it. Just, just chill out and stop. Stop uploading MMD dance videos. <laughs> I'm gonna get scalped for this. Unless you made the motion yourself. We have, we have so many, so many hundreds of millions and millions and millions of dance videos all with the same motion, all with the same annoying Japanese songs. And it's like, I get it, it's, M it's MND, it's Miku Miku Dance. How can you tell me not to put a dance video to a system that has the word dance in it? It's like, I understand, friend. Chill. And I know, like, there's a lot of channels out there that um make dance videos and they 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 use recycled motion and they put it to models that they like and i'm like if that's their thing that's their passion that's what makes them happy fine um i i'm not here to stop you exactly although i kind of am but it's like if it makes you happy like freaking ignore me who cares what i think but still it's a little discouraging when channels like this get i don't know three, four, five, six, ten thousand subscribers where people that are making their own motion that is fantastic only get like a hundred, two hundred, three hundred subscribers. It is baffling that people will continue to consume this, the trash that's put out on the corner when there's something that was like made by hand right there but there's but but the, but the trash is so great in volume that you never find that little nugget that little golden nugget <laughs> that's so worth your time that's what's discouraging and i don't mean that all dance videos are terrible and that you should never use recycled motion not what i mean it's just when you don't do anything you don't do anything truly creative with it um, you don't change any of the motion, you don't add to the motion, you don't change the camera angle. If you just go in and load in a bunch of models, and then load up the motion, and then render, you better not be saying a, a word about how proud you are of this, or or just, just how much time you put into it. It's like there's so many channels that are like that, they're so pretentious about their recycled motion. Oh my god. Take a look and my laser uh, channel. Um, they're one of my favorite MMDers ever. Not only do they make great original motion, but they do use recycled motion on like a somewhat regular basis. But the thing is, they use it what I consider the best way possible. And that is you add your own motion, you add things that are creative to it, you kind of put your own spin on it. So that there's a reason for me to click on your video and not click on the tens of thousands of other duplicates that there are out there. Uh, what they do is they build up a scenario so that the dance, the reason why these characters are dancing this way makes sense or make enough sense in the situation that they've made. It's fantastic. Not to mention the effects are gorgeous. The motion that, she, that they make on their own is like phenomenal. So on and so forth. Talented, talented, talented animator. Check him out. I understand that most people starting off in MMD will just use recycled motion to see how the system works, to see how everything functions, and that's perfectly acceptable. If you're new to MMD, use as much recycled motion as you want. You need to get a grasp on the system. I get it. But I'm just saying, for those that are a bit further along, do we really need to keep doing this? Is it that entertaining to see Papyrus and Sans dance to drop pop candy, which isn't even a good song to me? Oh my god, I hate it so much. I hate it so much. And note, the majority of this issue is with the American MMT community. I don't know why. I don't know if it's just, just sheer laziness, ignorance, or just... Just... I don't even know. I don't know. Because... Not only are there like a huge abundance of wonderful, creative, different, original MMD videos coming from Japan, but they also make plenty of the dance motion. But not only do they use it in that really nice blend of recycled motion and new creative ideas, but the majority of the time when I see it, 
It's just when they're showing off a model. Like, and I mean showing off a model like they made, so they can show that the physics work properly, so on and so forth. That. Now that. I love that. That's, that's, I think that's a wonderful use for recycled motion. I kind of wish that was the sole use for recycled motion for the most part. But no. What I'm stuck with is a bunch of pretentious, like, 17-year-olds who make nothing but recycled motion, add a couple of effects, they don't fix the motion to fit the model, it's broken, and then they upload it and they're like, oh, I'm so proud. Oh, this took me so long, and oh, I hope you like it. It's like... Part of me feels like I'm being mean just because I'm angry, so please know that this is just my opinion and a bit of me venting, but my god, I hate it. I hate it so much. And what's with all the TETA? What are with all, what's, what is with all the TDA models? I mean, they're pretty, I can see the appeal, but my god, it's every video, it's the TETA model, TETA, TETA, TETA. And then when I go on DeviantArt, what's every, what's every new model that's coming out? It's a TETA and a TETA and a TETA and it. And it's like, it's, it's nothing but. I love Tita, but I don't love it that much. Then me and Carol, we go on to DeviantArt on the MMD Undertale page and we see a bunch of new models that have been uploaded. Sweet! What are they? Recolored Tita with, like, nothing else changed. <laughs> it's just they give, they give Miku Hatsune yellow hair, a white shirt, and jeans, and they say, It's Alpheus! What even?! It's like, oh, I worked so hard. I'm sorry. I hate... Uh, I can't do this. Who am I? And when it comes to actual, like, original motion in MMD, like, you see a music video that is not a dancing music video. It's like, it's a character singing. Sweet. What is it all the time? Even with really talented motion, uh, motion makers. Animators. <laughs> um, what do you see? 80% of the time, it's a Tita model standing in an empty room with the camera going crazy and symmetrical arm movement and like good facial expressions and lip syncing. Great, but that's basically what it is. I, I, I really am yearning for something different and something new. It's so boring to see that, especially when the motion in it is actually decent and like they're improving and I respect their work. But my god, I've seen Miku Hatsun stand in a room and sing a song about 17,000 times before. Please stop. Th th there are other things to do. You can turn Miku Hatsun into a rocket ship and sh like put her into space and have her singing a song while she explodes. It's like if you did that, I'd be just as, I'd be so happy, so happy. And I'd, I'd give you thumbs up just for having the balls to do it. So the point of this video has kind of gotten lost, but my, my, my main point to um, newer MMD users, and even some that have been using it for a while, if you want to make a name for yourself, and you want to make like new, interesting content, don't strictly use recycled motion. Don't upload motion to a model that it doesn't fit with and then upload it, like the hands are clipping through the freaking head. There are ways to fix that. Look them up or don't upload it. It looks like crap. And no one says it looks like crap when it looks like crap. We need to be trying to set the bar higher, not lower, because there's already so many people that don't know any better that come out with motion that doesn't look that great, but that's because of at the skill level that they are and usually the age that they are. Like I said, seven-year-olds get a hold of the system. It's, it's gonna happen. But if you're older than that and you know better, it's like, yeah, it's, it's a bit of responsibility. <laughs> Now, I only say this because people have come up to me and asked me what I think of their MMD videos or, or will I critique this or that, and they're using recycled motion! And I'm like, what is there to critique? You didn't make it! You didn't make it! <laughs> oh, Christ. And finally, that leads us to our last and kind of most important talking point, so congrats if you listened to me shout at you for 10 minutes. Um, is the stealing, the amount of stolen motion, content in general, models, model parts, videos, so on and so forth. It is out of control. It's not something I often complain about, um, publicly, <laughs> because, uh, 
is a lot of people that view my content, and I know some of you are subscribers, that's not cool, you steal my stuff and re-upload it on your channel like it's just like an okay thing to do. And then I know some of you try to police um, these people by saying you're gonna, um, uh, like, hit them for copyright infringement. Dude, like, firstly, half the music that I use is already copyright, so it's like, that's not gonna work. I don't own the characters that are used in the videos, I don't own the models, I don't own the music. So there's no, there's no action I can take, there's no action you can take, it's just whether or not the person doing it is being a douche or not. And you're being a jerk by re-uploading a video um, that isn't yours and changing nothing about it. Now let me be clear. I'm cool with people using um, my videos or clips from my videos in something like a music video with a bunch of other content in it or something like that. As long as you make something new and creative with it, I am so okay with that. You don't even, like, I really like it when you ask because I like to see it instead of me having to, like, look it up, which I've often had to do, but that's fine. Um, but, like, I appreciate when you ask, and I, but I really, I love to see what you do with it. But when you just re-upload it and change nothing about it, you're just re-uploading my video hoping to get some sort of, I don't know, in inflow of views because it's my video and my work. I don't, I don't know what you're looking to gain from that except my anger because I get angry. <laughs> um, so basically the same thing's been happening to a lot of MMD users good talented animators either their videos are being stolen or their motion is being stolen by th these people these animators are so gracious to give you their motion you guys know i don't give away motion and this is exactly why because some people just steal it they say oh yeah i made this or they make like the tiniest little change and then they claim it that oh holy moly that's the worst. <laughs> oh my god. And because of this, we're losing content creators, we're losing animators, we're losing modelers left and right because you people don't know common courtesy. You don't do that. It's not an okay thing to do. And if you do it, you're gonna come to regret it. And I don't mean we're gonna come after you, harass you or anything like that. No, 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 no. You're gonna lose all these little outlets that you're stealing from because they're all gonna stop. That's what's gonna happen. <laughs> and then you'll have nothing. You're like, oh, where'd the MMD community go? Where? Why are there only seven second mi mimes? Vines? <laughs> With a like crappy motion where they don't even bend their arms. Where, 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 where can I steal from? It's like, they're all gone. They're leaving. They're gone. <sighs> it's, 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 it's madness. Like, Crap like this will never make me stop making content. It just, it's just discouraging and it's really disgusting. So just, just knock it off. Those of you who do do it. I know the majority of you listening are sweet little cinnamon rolls and I love you. But to the small minority, <laughs> knock it off. And if you're seven, knock it off. And I don't know if I'm saying knock it off, like stop being seven or stop being stupid. It's a little bit of both. <laughs> oh my god. Anyhow, that was a rant. That was fair warning. That was me venting. And I did it. I did it for almost 15 minutes. Can you believe it? I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. If you listened to all of this, congratulations. You've won, my love and care. So... <laughs> Thanks. Thank you very much for listening to me ramble at you for almost 15 minutes. And, uh, 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 <laughs> animations will be coming soon. I'm working on them. And, and, uh, hopefully this will brighten my mood so I can keep moving forward instead of being depressed that a lot of my favorite animators aren't making content anymore. But it's all good. So thank you, uh, and and I'll and I'll see you all later. Keep being amazing. Please thank you. Bye.